Yo, 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 YouTube, back with another sales day video for the weekend. We had a pretty big weekend of activity. Got a good selection of cards to show you. I did get my COVID vaccination Saturday morning after work. Um, so I, I had a moment of um, brain ineptitude, if you will. <clears throat> and I packed this without showing you guys what it is. But anyway... So it's this giant box of all these top loaded, just tops base cards, or not tops, but um, Farv base cards. It's 197 cards, and they were all on auction on my second account. And I had a customer message me and ask me if he could just buy them all outright and then pay for them to be top loaded and shipped. So that's what these all are. So that was a good, good sale for me. Sold 197 common base cards and I'll get that shipped out <clears throat> that's got to go FedEx it got heavy with all the top loads in it and then this is the rest of what I've sold this weekend so we'll do the first one here is a this is all store sales none of these were auction this is a 2004 tops 1996 score footsteps with Steve McNair 2004 Hog Heaven. Two thousand nine SP Signature, I want to say. Yeah, Signature Edition. <clears throat> 96 Pro Line, and then this is the special Super Bowl stamp. So you probably just saw this on my mail day video. I just got some of these in in a lot that I bought. Got one sold already. A 2002 on the game. A little tops insert. Um, again, on the latest mail day video, you saw I got some tops base and this off centered tops gold. Sold the gold already. You can't, uh, can't hold on to those golds. That, that is a hot, hot item. And then I sold two of these landmark junior sales. <clears throat> I did a mail day where I bought a huge lot of these. I got some Farves, some Myers, some Rice, and some Junior Sale. Had two Junior Sales. Um, I listed all of all of the uh, the extras that I didn't need, and the two Junior Sales sold already. That was nice. Those are nice and heavy. Those will be fun to ship. I did charge shipping for those just because of how heavy they are. Normally, I do for shipping on cards. Um, again, this was one that I got with that ninety-two tops gold. This is the special effects die cut version of the hologram. I think this is 96, 95 upper deck. So let's flip that pretty quick too. 2004 bazooka. Two thousand two Pacific exclusive. Fun little prism card there. And then I had a buyer buy all of these. So he bought a <clears throat> Nionics Reciprocal and then 10 of the Holographics base cards. So selling some stuff in bulk, that's always, that's always good. Clears things out, makes some space. And then I had a buyer buy a bunch of PSA 10 stuff. The first one is the 2002 Bowman Chrome, just the base card. 2006 Ultra, the gold parallel. So it's got the gold instead of the silver on the back. Two thousand three Bowman Chrome. Two thousand four Tops Chrome. PSA 10 and last and the last one the big one the 07 Bowman Chrome Refractor PSA 10 <clears throat> super nice looking card got this way cheap back in the day when uh, people weren't really buying these I feel like I was the only one turned out to be a good move sold quite a few of this type of stuff for really big gains all right, so that concludes our sales day weekend. 
video. Thank you so much for joining us. Please consider liking, subscribing, ring the bell for notifications for future videos, and we'll see you again soon.